All right, everybody. Um, finally, I'm getting the chance and the opportunity to record a. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. I'm getting the opportunity to record a leg day. Um, it seems like whenever I tell people I'm going to work out legs, nobody wants to come work out with me. But today, uh, one of my com bikini competitors training for a show, um, she decided that she wants to join me for a leg day. So then I'm gonna do legs and biceps. Um, I've been doing arms like three, four times a week. Um, I really wanna bring up my arms and grow my biceps. So I'm gonna do legs for sure and probably add in some uh, buys and tries. Um, so I'm at Gold's Gym Venice right now. Uh, I decided because I got a day away from my kids. Um, I brought them, dropped them off to you know one of their old sitters that hasn't seen them in a while. And um, I decided to come to, come here. I like to come here whenever I can, which is not often. But um, it's just a really big gym, uh, bodybuilding, tailor made, like a lot of exercises and machines that you aren't gonna find anywhere except for like the real hardcore gyms. Uh, I don't ever want to live like out this way because there's too much traffic and parking is just a bitch everywhere. But with that being said. When I, whenever I do get a chance to visit and come out here, I will. So I've never been to the Firehouse restaurant, I believe it's called, that they always talk about. So I'm gonna look to go there afterwards. But I'm about to go in here right now. Um, I just took my pre-workout. I'm about to smash some legs. I'll probably throw on a little shorts for y'all. You know, I gotta kinda show out whenever I go out to places. So see you in a minute. And I just mentioned parking, like, I have to walk all, it's like four blocks, uh, just to get on the right street to get to this gym. Um, parking sucks out here so bad, and the gym only has a parking lot for, uh, apparently for Gold's Gym members, which is not a bad thing. But it is, if you ever come out to Gold's Gym, be prepared if you come out on a day like a Saturday, the middle of the day. Uh, be prepared to walk. Um, it's killing time right now, actually. Probably delete most of this anyway, so you won't be seeing this rant. Um, and I'm kind of lost, too. So. We're going to make it. Most important part of the workout stretch. And this girl right here talking about some. What is a foam roller? What is this? I've never seen this before. Do you even lift, bruh? Do you even lift or no? <laughs> kind of trip me out. Well, we're gonna stretch, we're gonna warm up the hips, and then we're gonna get some squats. Yeah. <clears throat> hey. Yeah, partially functional. Half of me is comfortable, the other half is close to the cliff, like Mrs. Huxtable. These boys got them hostess and clips, they pack like Lunchables, like white boys in grade school, while we ate school made food, just eyeing they shit, wish I was trying they shit, knowing when mama hit the stove, she wasn't buying that shit, no I ain't crying a bit, man that's just life, that's how that shit work, you reach your hand to fire, you pull it back when you get burnt, gotta learn when you get hurt, even if it's with you, he beat you and you went back, he's officially stupid, oh yeah, I I understand that's your man, you had a plan You've been together for some years You sticking with him for the kids So you overlook the tears But we both know that's a bad look Cause 20 years from now your daughter probably get her ass whooped Look, if this too deep for the intro I find another use But just in case it's perfect Let me introduce Cole Hey Too deep for the intro, if so, I find another use But just in case it's perfect, let me introduce It's cold, I had a dream and so I made a move A ill ass nigga who just so happened to stay in school Still rap for hustlers and motherfuckers that hated school 
said that's for busters Then heard my shit and I made it cool It's safe to say that I'm gifted as if I'm Christmas shopping I got gangsta niggas lining up in that mission's office Ain't possibly cause all the hoes and niggas scrape A lot of shit up on my plate So you know a nigga late to my first class I much rather sit up in first class Should I admit that a slutty bitch was my first smash? Was it experience so nah I didn't wear it out Always thought my first time would be someone I cared about But being a virgin was something to be embarrassed about I used to ask for practice so I wasn't scared out my mind You call them rhymes, I call it clearing out my mind Was just a young boy staring out my blinds Till I got free from my mama leash Running loose through the streets like a straight dog in heat And we looking for some freaks, can you play? Pardon me, what's your name? Don't mistake me for no lame, no not me She knew I was on the team, cause she seen how tall I be In the club, dapping niggas, eventually R.I.P. Damn, you win some, you lose some, that's just how it happens And if a nigga step up to you, then you gotta scrap him yeah. Uh, growing and developing your legs um, and the main thing is most people really don't sit down and, and create a goal for themselves or create structure you have to sit down and analyze what it is that you want to do to a particular body part and we're talking about legs right now do you want bigger glutes or do you want more striated hamstrings uh, do you want bigger quads or do you want bigger overall legs like what is your main focus me personally my main focus is uh, calves and quads I want to bring up the size of my legs um, the appearance I don't want a bigger butt um, my my hamstrings are really really like striated in there uh, very prominent so I don't really need to do a whole lot of back squats and like you know things like that and I don't really have an interest of bringing up my butt um, but I do want to bring up my quads and calves so I'm going to be doing more front squats uh, more hack squats and whatnot but I do have to do the complete you know regimen because I want everything to stay uh, symmetrical so I uh, today was a uh, hamstring and a uh, hamstring and glute day um, so I did a lot of work for those muscle groups and then I did a little bit of biceps um, so I was able to get that on film but understand what you're trying to do whenever you are uh, in the gym most women you if you want to get a bigger butt you have to do a lot of isolated glute exercises and you have to squat heavy and get you know your butt as low to the ground as possible because when you're doing a back squat um, whenever you break parallel you rec rec recruit heavily your hamstrings and your quads so the person I was working out with today Tati you know I was telling her you know you really have to get down deep into your squats in order to recruit those glute muscles in, in order to recruit those um, hamstring muscles which you see the separation between the top women in the bikini world and the average is you know most likely going to be like the tone in their legs and the women who get that ass down and work are going to have you know a more rounded developed glutes uh, and then for guys we need to pretty much do a lot of uh, reverse uh, hack squats we need to do a lot of walking lunges we need to do a lot of front squats front squats front squats to build up those quads um, so be cautious and mindful about what it is that you're trying to achieve uh, when you go to the gym don't just always look to have a heavy back squat quick story max chewing is popular on youtube and he had a post and he was talking about how you know he squats heavy he squats like four or five hundred pounds or he's getting close to 500 pounds or something like that but his legs don't look like it and that's you know because he's back squatting i've never seen him front squat at all you know it's squat day squat day and the squat day always revolves around a back squat so his legs you know his quads will never really grow because he's not putting the tension on his quads chris jones has big ass quads he does nothing but front squat and so it's obvious like yeah genetics play a role but you have to stimulate the muscle correctly in order for it to grow so if you're trying to get a bigger butt and you don't back squat it's not going to happen if you're trying to get bigger quads thicker quads and you don't front squat or you don't hack squat it's not going to happen so uh, understand what you're trying to achieve go in there create a plan execute the plan and uh yeah so he like it um you know i really really like the mecca because 
Uh, it's a very, very hot gym. It's warm in there. Um, there's motivation from everywhere. Like when I was doing, uh, I didn't record it, but I did 315 uh, for two reps. I just did two because I wanted to see how it felt because I haven't squatted that heavy. You know, I'm working my way back up from out of my contest prep, my, my deficit. And the guy next to me was like, what's up, man? Like you had about two or three more in you. And it was just a good ass person, like a good ass conversation. He was just encouraging me to you know push past you know the the level of pain you know don't be scared to drop it and that's what they got the safety bar for you know asked me if i was doing classic physique i told him no i don't you know i don't not right now he's you know it was, it was a really cool guy but you get that at these gyms you get people who are uh humble people who've been there their whole lives people who are serious about training um people who are bodybuilders and you you get into the bodybuilder community and it's something that i miss being here here inland with, with having nothing but commercial gyms which is why I'm really anxious to get our gym up and running um, you know here here soon so uh, something I'm really gonna be adamant about this month is to make sure that we get things done but anyways um, you know I hope you enjoyed the video hope you got something out of it hope you learned a little bit more about you know developing your legs um, I believe uh, I'm going to I really want to record it a proper chest day because um, a lot of people have questions about developing the chest so I think that's gonna be my next video we'll see but we'll see you guys soon thanks for listening don't forget please like comment subscribe all that good stuff helps your boy peace